Yasmin, for nearly seven decades, it was the principal and largest international air carrier and came to define the world of air travel. But Pan Am's financial collapse in 1991 signaled the end of an era and made the brand a part of American history. The airline's legacy has sparked a new ABC primetime drama following the fictional stories of the airline's flight attendants and pilots. And Hawaii's own history is actually closely linked with the airline having served as the first stop for its first Trans-Pacific flight back in 1935. So in honor of the 75th anniversary of that flight, the Pacific Aviation Museum has launched a special exhibit. KITV4's Jill Kuramoto takes us for a live ride. Good morning, Jill. Good morning, Mahia and Kenny. Yes, it was 75 years ago that Pan Am made that first commercial passenger flight from the mainland to Hawaii. It was a milestone uh, as far as aviation history and and Hawaii history because it really did open up Hawaii to the rest of the world. And now there is a new exhibit that opens officially tomorrow here at the Pacific Aviation Museum. And it's all about Pan Am. And when you come down, check it out, you're going to feel like you're looking inside the plane of a passenger uh, airplane. It's really kind of cool. And the man behind that is Mac McKellar. And he's had his hand in just about every exhibit here at the museum. And Mac, you were telling me, though, that this exhibit, this particular exhibit, was probably the most challenging for you. Why is that? Well, it's usually scheduling, uh, trying to match uh, the timeline that we have to have to accomplish uh, an exhibit such as this. And it's our volunteer staff that greatly uh, help me uh, and our other staff members uh, accomplish a, a project such as this. And you were telling me, though, that this exhibit is probably going to continue to grow and, and evolve, right? Yes, uh, I understand we've got a few mannequins that we're going to dress up in the, the Pan Am uh, attire and uh, display them, so. Okay, all right, thanks.